guys. Looks like we are live. All right, hi everyone. Glad to be back with you guys. Thanks for joining. We've got 4 p.m. Pilates coming your way. We've got a Pilates hit class today. So lots of Pilates, lots of high intensity interval training. Um, we will get sweaty and we will also do lots of core today. Um, grab your weights. I've got four pound weights today. I recommend just light weights. Um, any light weights will do. Let me fix my little camera here. Any light weights will work for today as long as you have weights and water. Water is necessary. Your mat. Let's see if we can see myself here. All right. It looks like we can see just fine. I'm Katie. I haven't been here in a while, but I'm back with you. Happy to be back. Thanks for joining, y'all. Grab your light weights. We'll get started in about, hey, Ashley. We'll get started in about uh, 30 seconds. We've got about a 45 minute Pilates hit class today. We will um, get sweaty. We'll work hard. So glad to be back with y'all. I missed you. I think that I was gone for, you're not teaching for about a month. So happy to be back. Uh, pl uh, playlist. I almost forgot. Uh, your playlist is Pilates 628. That's today. And it's available on the True Tribe ATX Facebook page. I just posted it about 10 minutes ago, so go grab it. I'm on a 12 second crossfade, the furthest crossfade you can get. And uh, it's a great playlist, so you're gonna want it. We will get started. All right guys, grab your weights, your mat, your water, playlist, and we'll get going. I'll count you down to start your playlist. We will be starting seated. So find a comfortable seat if you're playing your playlist. Get it turned up nice and loud. We will start your playlist in three, two, one. Start seated here with me. Make sure your weights are nearby, towel is nearby. Just find a comfortable seat. Twist and tap to start. Nice and quick. Finding the beat here. If you need to start out a little slower, that works fine. Whatever feels good to you here. This first song is just to fire up your core, to get your body moving, get your spine moving. Start to bring you into this space, bring you into your workout. We'll add your arms, half speed on your twist in five, four, three, two, one. Arms up. Pull. Pull your elbows down. Engage your lats. Engage your core. Really twist as far as you can side to side. Pull. Pull. Feet come flat in three, two, one. Deep flat hands behind your head. Sit up nice and tall. Widen out your elbows. Right and left. Just a twist and a little lean. Really try to look behind you here. Maybe take your lean just a little further back every single time. Twist. Stay with it, belly to spine. In five. In four. Both pose. Three. Two. One. Both pose. Hands at heart center, roll your shoulders back. Russian twist. Finding motion in your spine. Squeeze your knees together. Squeeze your hands together. Try to keep your hands at heart center as you twist. Twist. Yes. We'll roll it down to your forearms. In 10 more seconds, five, four, three, two, 
One, roll it down to your forearms. Knees come to tabletop here. Head stays lifted, gazing at your knees. Out, open, close, in. Reach. Reach. You're taking a slight C curve in your spine. Holding your rib cage closed. Reach. Point through your toes. Widen out your fingertips, keep your chest lifted. You'll hold it out, just the out and in. Three, two, one. Hold it out, just open, close. Really squeeze your inner thighs to bring your legs back to center. Point through your toes. Laying it all the way down in five, four, three, two, one. Feet flat, lay it all the way down. Bring your knees hips distance apart. Reset your spine here, reset your hips. Reach left, right, left, and right. Feet stay flat, just catching the beat here. Try to relax your head, your neck, so that you're not straining your neck. Focusing in on your core here. Breathe. In five, four, three, two, one. Knees to tabletop. Lift your head, neck, and chest. Roll it up off the ground. Send your left leg long. Left hand to your knee, right hand to your calf. Switch, switch. Single leg stretch. Maybe add just a little twist side to side, pulling your elbows down a little lower than you might normally. That engages your obliques just a little bit more. Stay with it. Single leg stretch. Switch, switch. Switch. Five, four, in three, left flat, two, in one, left foot flat, right leg, elbow to knee. Crunch it up. Right leg long, both hands long. Same motion. Right leg will stay straight in five, four, three, two, one. Bring it straight. Up, reach. It doesn't have to be a huge range of motion. Just keep your leg pointed. Three, two, one. One, reach behind your thighs and your left leg long. Pull, pull, switch. Single straight leg stretch. It's a pull, pull, and switch. Sniff, sniff, exhale, breath. Legs straight and strong. Five, four, three, two, one. One, right foot flat, bend your knee, elbow to your left knee, other side. Crunch it up, pull it in. Crunch, crunch, stay with me. Left leg will stay straight. Three, two, one, bring it straight. Reach, reach, let it burn, I know. Almost there, almost there, almost there. Five, four, three, two, one. Keep your left leg high, bring your right leg to meet it. Hands come behind your head, neck, and chest. Roll your shoulder blades up, flex your feet to lower, point to lift. Flex to lower, point to lift. Double straight leg stretch. Flex to lower, point to lift. Stay with it. 
almost there. We'll rock it up. Grab your weights in five, four, three, two, one. Roll along your spine. Roll up over your feet, over your knees. I'm going to face you. Grab your weights. I want you standing tall on your knees. Weights come up in line with your ears. Just press, press, press. There we go. I'm noticing the camera is a little bit dark today. It looks a little better now. But just listen for cues and move to the beat. If you miss something, that's okay. Maybe try on something different. Try what feels good. Little arm burner here. Get full range with control. Five, four, three, two, one. Hold it here, reach out, in. Wide bicep curl. Elbows staying in line with your shoulders. Pull your rib cage together, squeeze your booty. We take it to the front. Three, two, one to the front. Out, out. Hammer curl. Elbows are still nice and high. Big breaths in, big breaths out. Five, four, three, two, one. Hold it here, little pulse, little pulse. Release your fingertips, just pulse from your elbows, pulling your shoulders down. Little pulse, little pulse, I know. We open up, alternating arms. Three, two, one, alternate it. Right, left, right, left. Stay strong. Good. Five, four, three, two, one. Tuck your elbows into your rib cage. Reach, reach. It's W press, alternating your arms. Really squeeze your elbow like you're going to touch them behind your back. There we go. If you're feeling strong. Maybe take both. Flex your bicep. We serve it out to the front. Three, two, one. Take it front. Left, right. Don't lose that squeeze in your lats. Still pulling your elbow back. Yes. Five, hold it out in four, three, two, one. Hold it out, little pulse, little pulse, little pulse. Yes, four, three, two, one. Lower down, shake out your shoulders. You can set your weights down, towel off if you need it. Grab water if you need it. We're heading forward into a plank position. Hope you guys are doing okay. If you're ready, Go ahead and rock it forward to a plank. Shoot me an emoji if you're feeling okay today. Hands down, toes down, widen out your feet so that they're greater than hips distance apart. You've got opposite hand to opposite knee. Just tap, just tap, tap, tap. You're gonna have to tighten your core to hit palm to knee with control. 10 more seconds here. Five, switch it out. Four, three, two, one. Other side, just tap. Work to the beat. Squeeze, squeeze. 20 second intervals here. Five, four to your forearms. In three, two, one. Down to your forearms, hip dips. Hip dips. For more challenge, turn your palms to the ceiling. Really stabilize. 
through your rib cage. Yes. Level ups. Three, two, one. Level ups. Take it right, right, and left, right. I don't know my right from left apparently today, but you're alternating the lead hand every time. Ten seconds. Eight seconds. Land on your hands, full plank, in five, four, knees in, in three, two, one, knees in, right, left. Drive opposite knee, opposite elbow. Try to keep your hips down, strong plank position, filling this space between your shoulder blades, six, five, Four, three, two, one. Last set, plank jacks. Last 20. Out and in. Out and in. Yes. Down dog. Coming your way. Last five and five. Four, three, two, one. Send your booty up and back. Just pedal out your knees. Pedal out your feet. Pulse through your chest. Pulsing your chest towards your thighs. Big inhale here. Big exhale. You're sending it back into a plank position in five, four, three, two, one. Back to a plank position. 20 second cardio intervals. Your first set. Walk it in, in, out, out. Switching your lead leg every time. I know we've got a little bit of high intensity work back to back, but I haven't seen you guys in a while. So we gotta find a little sweat here. Yes. You'll meet me feet to the ground, squat position. Three, two, one. Feet to the ground, jump squats. Jump it up, get your booty low. This one's one of my favorites right now for cardio. 10 seconds. Maybe turn it up. Dump it out. Find a little bit more. Five. In four. Three. Two. One. Hands behind your head. Opposite knee. Opposite elbow. Just one side. Yes. Really twist it out. Bend into your standing leg. Yes. Last five. Left leg will go back. Four, three, two, one. Lunge and kick. It's a lunge and kick. The same leg that you are pulling in, you're sending back and kicking up. Yes. Five, four, three, two, one. Back to your jump squats. Back to your jump squats. 20 seconds here. How high can you jump? Working to get your heart rate up. Other leg coming in. Three, two, one. Other side. Opposite elbow, opposite knee. Whatever leg you didn't do before, that's the leg you're on. Just a slight tap of your toe down to the earth. Pick it right back up. Draw it in. Sending your right leg back to a lunge position. Kicking at the top. Three, two, one. Send it back. Kick it up. 20 seconds. Make it nice and quick here. Try not to slam your knee on the ground like I just did. <laughs> Use control, lower down, kick it up. It's okay if your kick isn't high, don't worry about that. Five, four, three, two, one. Last set of your jump squats. Last set, get low, jump it high. 20 seconds, 20 seconds. 
Yes. Less than 10. Less than 10. Three, two, one. Last set of cardio. Jump lunges. You're switching, switching. If you don't like the jump here, just step it back for your lunges. 20 seconds here. Final 20. You've got a recovery. Less than 10. Less than 10. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. Step it side to side. Big inhales. Big exhales. Towel off, grab water if you'd like. Cheers, you guys. Cheers to Sunday. Starting our week off right. Thanks for joining me, you guys. Grab one more big breath in. Grab a sip of water. And then grab your weight. Turn to face the side of your mat. Turn to face the side of your mat. Side lunge series coming your way. Feet are flat. Toes are facing directly to the side of your mat. Left side first. Weights down, bicep. For side lunges, you're bending into one leg, sending your booty back. Other leg stays straight. I'm gonna show you the side view here. Booty goes back. Knee is pressing your booty back trying to find 90-90 position. The weight is in your heel. Still on your left side. Upper arm, glue to your side body. We pulse it low. Five, four, Three, two, one. Hold it halfway. Just pulse, pulse, pulse. Flex your biceps. Lift your chest. Lean into your heel. Pulse, pulse, pulse. Catch the beat. Breathe. Let it burn. Let it shake. Switching sides. Five, four, three, two, one. Switch it out. Low, bicep. Curl, curl. Remember, booty back, left leg straight. Low, lift. With control, keep your core engaged. Low, lift. Stay with your breath. One set of pulses. Five, four, three, two, and one. Little pulse, little pulse. Send your booty back, flex your biceps, chest lifted. Pulse, left leg stays straight. Yes, you can. Good, and five. In four, three, two, one. Stand it up, shake it out. You can lift your legs, maybe do a couple butt kickers if that feels all right. Keep your weights with you. Turn to face the front of your mat. Turn to face the front. I'm sending my left leg back to start. We're meeting 90 90 lunges where you start. Weights are high, low, pull. You're trying to make your elbows meet your rib cage. Knee is just lifting to a 90 degree. It's more about the plyometric here, less about the full range lunge. I'm more worried about low lift. Keep the beat, find some spring off your left leg. Low lift. Low. You're driving your knee up, driving your elbows back. Find your breath here. It's supposed to be just a little bit of a cardio burst. 
Only one set of the lunge and pull. Stay with it. Five, four, three, two, one. Hold your lunge low. Left leg is back. Weight at heart center. Pulse it over your front right leg. Pulse. Hold your lunge low. 90-90 lunge. You're going to have to squeeze between your inner thighs for balance. Important here, weights are staying at heart center. You're twisting from your obliques, not just taking your weights forward and back. The pulses from your obliques. In five, four, three, two, one. Step your right foot to the left side. Cross it over curtsy lunge position. Weights lower and lift, full range, shake it low, lift, curtsy lunge, right forward, left crosses over behind, wide bicep curl, wide curl, if your weights are really light today and you want an extra challenge on the upper body, take a W press. You're still working your biceps. It just gets your heart rate up a little more. Hold your full range curtsy. Hang on to your wide bicep curl. Five, four, three, two, one. Hold it low, hold your bicep curl. Little pulse, little pulse. Flex your biceps, hold it halfway. Five, four, three, two, one. Step your left foot up, right leg back. Start in your 90 90 lunge, lunge, pull. Other side. Right leg goes back, right knee pulls up. Again, remember your goal is to work to the beat, finding the plyometric movement, less so than getting full range in your lunge. Inhale, exhale to pull. Breathe through. In five. Four, three, two, in one. Weight to heart center. Pulse it over your front left leg. Hold low. Little pulse. Little pulse. Check out where your weights are right now. If they're under your left armpit, bring them back to the center of your chest and take your chest towards the left side of the room. That's how you'll find your obliques. Pulse. Full range curtsy coming your way. Five, four, three, two, one. Walk your left foot to the right side. Back foot crosses behind. Take it low. Lift. Full range curtsy with a wide bicep. Low, lift, low, lift. Pretty close to the same beat here. Go right through into the next track. Full range curtsy. Yes. If you can't see your right leg behind you crossing over, reset your lower body. Low, lift. Squeeze your inner thighs. Remember, advanced variation, W press. Hold low, pulse low. Three, two, one, pulse. Pulse. 
Hold your curtsy. Use your inner thighs. Squeeze them together. Hold the 90-90 bend, just pulse. In eight, seven, six, in five, four, three, two, one. Stand it up, shake out your legs. Breathe here. If you need a break, you need water, you need to towel off, take it here. If you don't, or if you're not sure, meet me in a chair squat position. Lean into your heels, squeeze your knees all the way together. Tricep kick. Bend your knees. I want you to feel your inner thighs because you're squeezing your knees together so much. Alternating tricep kick. Yeah. Five, four, three, two, one. Shake it out. Step your foot back. Beat me in a sumo squat facing the side of your mat. Keep your weights with you. Come low into your sumo squat. Send your knees wide. Tuck your booty under. Quick alternating bicep. Little sway in your sumo. There we go. Remember here. You're trying not to just dump your stomach forward, tuck your booty under. Hold your belly to spine, connection. Hold that alternating bicep curl. Five, four, three, two, one, in and out, pull in, out. Alternating, serve it out. If you're feeling real strong, you can take both. But the most important thing is that you're moving with control. If you're not, take alternating. You'll hold it out, palms stay up. Three, two, one, hold it out, little tap, little tap. If your legs are shot, you can stand up, like straight. If you're not sure, stay in your sumo. Five palms down in four, three, two, one. Palms down, little cross. Just a soft bend in your elbows. Shoulders stay away from your ears, little cross. Yes, don't lose it. Five, four, three, two, one. Pull in, in, alternating wide row. Right, left. For your wide row, elbows stay in line with your shoulders. You're holding your weights up. Just pull, pull. Almost there, almost there. Five, four, three, two, one, you can stand up out of your sumo squat. You're gonna to wanna to keep your weights with you. You can step it side to side to get your breath back under control. We've got a cardio burst. So if you need to towel off, if you need water, take it here. We start in 15 seconds. 10 seconds. You need your weight, stay facing the side of your mat. Alternating tap, squat jumps. Three, two, one, tap it down, hold your weights with control. 20 second intervals for your cardio burst. With control, with control. Yes. Side to side lunges. Three, two, one, double pulse. Take it left, right, left, right. Double pulse. Double pulse. The side that you're not leaning into stays really straight. 
That's where you'll find the booty work. High knees, 10, four, three, two, one. High knees, knees to your weight. Hold your weight, squeeze them with control. Bring your knees up to your weight. 12 seconds, 12 seconds. Back to side to side lunges. Four, three, two, one. Pulse it left, right, left, right. Send your booty back. Keep your chest lifted. Get low, make it worth it. Yes. Your side to side lunges are an opportunity to catch your breath. Five, four, three, two, one. Sumo punches as fast as you can. With control, if you want to drop your weight, drop them down. Hold your weight in front of your face. Bring them back to your chin every single time. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one side to side. Double pulse. Double pulse. Yes. Breathe. Breathe. Yes, you can. Five. In four. Three, two, one. Hold your weights with control. 180 squat jumps. Switch directions as you like. 20 seconds here. In 180 squat jumps, hold your weights with control. Yes. Ending with alternating tap squat jumps. Five, four, three, two, one, tap it down, in and out. Bring your weight back to that 90 degree hold in between every jump, 10 seconds. Finish, finish here. Five, four, three, two, one. Breathe here. Just step side to side, tap it out. You can set your weights down. We're taking a break from your weights for just a moment. Towel off, grab water if you need. I'm sweating. <laughs> How are you guys doing? Shoot me some emojis when you have a second. We're heading back down to your mat. When you're ready, set your weights to the side, grab water, towel off. You can flow it down if that feels good. But we are meeting in a plank position. If you wanna flow it down, you can come through warrior two, windmill it down. Maybe take a low plank, upward facing dog, stretching out, flip to the balls of your feet, downward facing dog. We shift forward to a plank. Five, four, three, two, one. Shift forward to a plank, you've got walking push-ups. Move your weights out of the way. Open up to the left, press. Step your right arm out, press. 20 seconds here. Your modified variation. Knees are down, same motion. Opening left, together, opening right. Just tuck your knees into your booty, squeeze your core. Five, four, Three, two, one, sit it back, 20 second break. 20 second break. Breathe here. It's a push up series, but I didn't want to tell you that because I don't want you to be discouraged. We're going to make it through, I promise you. 20 seconds coming on. You've got a narrow push up. You'll be on your knees to keep it nice and tight. Three, two, one. Low, lift. Low, lift. Elbows grazing the side of your rib cage. If you want to take it faster, go for it. 
low, lift, eight seconds, 20 second break coming in, five, four, three, two, one, sit it back, 20 seconds off, breathe here, breathe here. Take a look around your house. Do you have something you can put your feet up on? Feet raised for your next set. I'm gonna put my feet up here on my couch. It's kinda high, so bear with me. Three, two, one. Feet are raised nice and wide through your elbows. Try to keep your belly engaged. 10 seconds. 20 seconds off. Four, three, two, one. Knees down. Take a break, take a break. 20 seconds off, your final set is coming your way. Standard wide arm push up. Three, two, one. Standard wide arm. It's your last set of 20 seconds. How many can you press? Get strong right here. 10 seconds, 10 seconds, press it out. Three, two, one. Sit it back. Grab water if you need. Interlace your fingers behind you. Stretch out your chest. Stretch out your triceps. Maybe stretch out your neck. If you felt tight there. Just breathe. All right, recovering your breath. You'll meet me in a tabletop position. If you want a band, we are working booty. Slide it up above your knees, but you don't need a band, I promise. Tabletop, loop kick up, left side, lift, lift, lift. Today I want you to focus on keeping your hips level, keeping your shoulders level, gaze down between your thumbs, lift, lift. Think about your left side glute and lift from your left side glute instead of from your heel. Hold it up, pulse it up. Three, two, one. Little pulse, little lift, little lift. Pulsing your glute pickup should not be easy. If you're not feeling it, lift higher, pull your rib cage together. Think about lifting from your left side glute. Flatten out the left sole of your foot. Hamstring curl coming your way. Three, two, one. Hold it up, reach out, in. You're holding at the top, the very tip top of your glute kick up. Holding the squeeze in your left side glute, leading with your heel. Don't let it drop. Five, four, three, two, one. Bring it down, hydrate, lift, lift, lift. For your hydrate, you don't have to take your hips level, um, unlevel, excuse me. Keep your hips closed, shoulders closed. Again, think about your left side glute and lift from the outside of your left side glute. Hold the flex in your left foot. Lift, lift, lift. Stay with it. Five, in four, three, two, one. Tuck your toes under, knee hover, knee hover. Little tap, little tap. Little tap. It's a tiny motion. We take it side to side, obliques. Three, two, one, obliques, tap. Little tap. Twisting on the balls of your feet. Holding the same space between your knees. Holding 90 degree bend. Little tap, tap. Five, four, three, two, one. Hold it here, hold it here, hold it here. 
Hold your knee hover. Yes, you can. For eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Drop it down. Breathe here. Going into the other side. Try to go straight into it. Flex your right foot. Loop kick up. Lift. 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 Same beat. Make it work the other side right here. Refocus. Hips close, shoulders close. Gaze between your thumbs. Lift from your right side booty. Lift. Lift. If you do this right, you should be burning out your booty. Lift. Lift. Yes. We pulse it up. Three, two, one. Little pulse. Little pulse. Hold at the very top. You should feel it in your right side booty and your right hamstring. Zip your rib cage up. Straighten out your shoulder. Gaze down. Lift up a little higher. Hamstring curl in three, two, one. Hold it here. Reach out. In. Tuck. Like you're going to kick your booty with your heel. Don't lose any of the lift. Pull. Stay with it, stay with it. Remember, lead with your heel. Hold to the very top of your glute lift. Five. Four. Three. Two, one, right side, hydrant. Lift, lift, lift. Remember, you're not sending your hips all the way to the other side of your mat every time you lift. Hips stay closed, shoulders stay closed. It's okay if you only lift a little. The purpose is tightening up your outer glute not how high you lift. Flex your foot. Five. In four. Three. Two. One. Knee hover, last set, reach right, left. Knees are hovering, reach out right, left. Right, left. Squeeze your booty, get full range. Reach, reach, yeah. Send the sole of your foot out behind you. Squeeze your leg all the way. Last 10 for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Lower it down. If you need a child's pose to stretch out your booty, take it here, knees apart. Send your hands out long. Maybe send it side to side to stretch out your booty. Breathing. Only one song, one song left of work right here. We're finishing with a core burnout. Just because we're laying down does not mean it's gonna be easy. So stay in the work mindset for just one more track. When you're ready, send it back to your back. We're starting out with the most challenging of your core exercises. So grab water, take a big breath in, exhale it out, and then send it back to your back. You're starting out 30 seconds here. Arms will go long, legs long. Exhale, V up, reaching your hands in between your legs. Inhale long, exhale, V up. 30 seconds here. You're in it. Let's go. If you need to, take it slow with control. 
If you're ready to knock it out, take it fast. Inhale, exhale to reach. Halfway there. Yes. Knees will come to tabletop. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three. And one, knees to tabletop. Lift your neck and chest gaze towards your knees. Send your left leg long, hands behind your head. Left armpit to your right hip. Switch, switch, crisscross. Twist through your obliques. Keep your elbows away from one another. Picture yourself touching armpit to your hip. 10 down, 20 seconds to go. You've got plenty of time in each exercise so that you can get into it, perfect it, burn it out before you're done. 10 seconds. Please come back to tabletop. Four, three, two, one. Knees back to tabletop, hands on the outside of your knees. Lift your chest back up, lift your shoulder blades up. Inhale long, exhale wrap around, double leg stretch. Inhale long, exhale wrap. Add a challenge, add an open close. Inhale long, open close. Wrap it around. 20 seconds to go right here. 20 seconds to go. Yes. Almost there, almost there. Five, four, three, two, one. Feet flat, lift your head, neck, and chest. Reach for your ankle bones. Oblique taps. Every time I teach these, in my mind I call them penguins because that's what I feel like <laughs> when I do this exercise. So maybe I'll call them penguins for you guys next time. Hold your shoulder blades up off the mat. Only one more exercise. Less than 15 seconds in your penguins. And then your final bit of work. Five. Four, three, two, one. Hands behind your head, neck, and chest. One more time. Right leg straight up, left leg straight out. Straight legged crisscross. Just like your crisscross. The legs are straight. This one is tough. Burn it out. It's your last bit of work. You're still working armpit to your hip connection. 15 seconds left in your work. Stay with it. Lift back up. Really twist through your obliques. We get to stretch it out. Last eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Lay it down. Send your legs out long. Breathe here. If you want to draw your knees in, if that feels good, maybe take some knee circles here. So drawing your knees apart, out and around, and switch directions. Just breathing. So good to be back with you guys today. Hope you're ready for another great week of working from home, of social distancing. <laughs> I know we're tired of it, but this is what our world is made up of right now, and that's okay. It's something to learn, it's stories to tell, so let's just lean into that and do the best we can with what we've got. Find a happy baby, flex your feet up to the ceiling, and pull your knees down to the earth. If you're feeling flexible, or maybe you just need a little tantrum. Take a tantrum, baby, here. You can straighten out alternating legs. Get those tantrums out before Monday. <laughs> and then hug your knees in here. Rock and roll along your spine. Rock up over your feet. And press back down, dog. Tuck your toes under. Maybe drop your shoulders, stretch it out here. Stretch out the backs of your legs once more. 
and drop your knees down, tabletop position. Inhale, open your left arm up high, thread the needle. Drop your shoulder down, your temple down. Hold in your thread the needle. Just gonna come talk to you guys before we, before we exit here. If you made it all the way through, thank you so much for joining. Um, I hope you got sweaty. I hope your core burned and that got all your tantrums out before Monday. <laughs> I'll be back with you guys um, next Sunday. Go ahead and switch out your thread the needle. Inhale, right arm up. Exhale, thread it under. Shoulder down, temple down. Maybe you're getting some nice crackling through your spine there. When you're ready, unravel. Come to a seat on your booty. Flex your feet out in front of you. Take one more stretch with me, big inhale. Exhale, forward fold. Reach for your feet, your ankles, your calves, whatever's available. This song is called Quarantine Queen. I might be late to the party. You all might already know about it, but it's one of my favorites right now. Inhale, sit up tall. Draw your legs in one last time. Thank you guys so much for making it all the way through with me. My name is Katie Rose. Um, feel, free to, feel free to find me on my personal Instagram as well. I'm trying to post a few workouts here and there for you guys. Otherwise, I will see you next Sunday at 4 p.m. Have an amazing, socially distanced, safe week. Thank you guys. Love you all.